dude, this bike is so old, it grows webs. God, every single time. Unless this bike has like a spider that lives underneath the seat. Check it out, watch. Take this web off. Right? Guarantee it's gonna be back in the same exact spot. I already did this before. I didn't think I have to record this, but now, and now it's an incident. Now we have an issue. We'll see if that happens again. Man, I need my V rod. Ay, ay, ay. It's so tight. Mm, look at that fine ass car. All right, look, check it out. This is like day two. Okay. The spider web is back. Oh, sh. Oh, sh. There it is. Yo, you just scared the sh out of me. That's what I've been riding with you. Get the f out of here. No, come on. Really? <sighs> you live in the seat? Yo. 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 Why? How you doing? Spider, and it won't come out. It's been there for like three days. I've been taking the web off. I'm like, yo, the web is back in the same exact spot. For like three days, it's been hanging on here. Wow. And every time I try to like poke it with a stick, it runs back in the seat. You can see it right there. You can see it right there. Oh, yeah. Every time that. I try to poke it, it runs right back in there. There it is. See it? I see it. Watch, I, I try to like poke at it and it runs back in. This web, every morning I come I'm like, yo, the same web, the same spot, same web. The day has come where I get to return this bad boy who's treated me so nicely. I finally get to go get my bike. Very exciting day. And partly is because there's a spider that lives under the seat of this motorcycle. Anybody who rides a motorcycle knows what it feels like to get your baby back, especially when your baby's got 120 horsepower, 90 pounds of foot torque. What? Did I say that right? Nice, Porsche. Out here in SoCal, Porsche is like the Prius of exotic cars. There are so many of them. So these guys at Glendale, they've been amazing to me. They didn't have to give me this loaner. I honestly don't know any motorcycle dealership that's willing to just loan out a motorcycle while they work on your bike. So I'm gonna do something nice for them. Let's fill her up for the last time. You still there, buddy? I can't see you, but I know you're there. Can I get like a, a variety of like donuts? Now getting it to the dealer on a bike. This is gonna be interesting. Glendale Harley, you guys are getting Dunkin' Donuts. Well, at least the service department. It's up to you guys if you want to let everybody else know. I mean, there's 12 in there. I ain't gonna tell you what to do with it. You want me to open that for you? <laughs> oh, you're welcome. Man, this makes me nervous. I feel like I'm gonna lose this box. Better idea. I should have thought of this in the first place. I mean, it's gonna be like this. We got this. Now we got this. Change, 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 change. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. And we're here. I think they're still okay. Hey, what's going on? I got you guys donuts. <laughs> donuts 
Yeah. There she is. God. It's been too long. This is for you guys. What? Damn, dude. <laughs> Your generosity is overwhelming. No, you guys are too good to me. Well, I'm going to set them out there and share for everybody. Is that cool? Oh, yeah. Do, do whatever you guys want to do with it. From Mr. Mr. V Rod. Here it is. Oh. Do I miss you? Yes, I do. Back on this sexy thing. You've been gone too long. Don't do that again. <laughs> They're fighting over the alcohol. <laughs> Where are you drifting into? Oh, because you're eating a sandwich and you're on your phone. That guy's drifting because he was eating a sandwich and he was on his phone. No hope. I have no hope for LA. This is what you got to deal with out here. Black African uh, gentleman mad at you guys and have him pick up a nuclear sub and just, you know, annihilate a thousand of you here and there, you know. That, that's dis disrespectful with all that noise, you know. You got to not just look at yourself and your need and just that culture, but you got to look in respect of other people, other culture and their uh, things too. Be, you know, one-sided. You got to always see two sides of the story, what I think, what I believe, my culture, and then the other person and uh, respect uh, equally. Yeah, you don't want to cause any inequality. Yeah. That's not cool. Yeah, that start wars. All right. And then in any war, the international and national government will need to win. Oh, God. What did I get myself into? All people and nation and foundation of society, and they have more tanks and nuclear bombs. Oh, man. All right, man. Take it easy. Freaking me out.